Hey, welcome back to another H1 video, and in today's video, I'm gonna be unboxing my brand new iPhone 16 Pro Max in Desert Titanium. Let's get into it. Okay, so like I said, welcome back to another H1 video. I am super excited because I just got my iPhone 16 Pro Max in the new Desert Titanium color. And yeah, I've been waiting for this package all day. It was supposed to get here like, like at nine in the morning. It is currently six o'clock in the afternoon. So I've been watching my little, you know, UPS driver drive all around my neighborhood, all around town. And I finally have my phone and I'm super excited. Big props to my UPS guy, Kevin, because bro, he actually apologized for being so late because he knows normally he comes in the morning to deliver my packages and the app said it was supposed to come in the morning. But anyway, Let's get into this unboxing now. This is just an unboxing. I'm gonna make a separate video where I go maybe in depth on the phone and give you my thoughts on it. This is just an unboxing, so let's do it. Tear off all that nice little Apple paper thingy here. Now this is my first time seeing this color in person, obviously, but I've seen a thousand videos of it. Here we go. Oh, there it goes. Wow, okay, this is definitely very rosy tinted. I didn't think it'd be this rosy-ish of a color. Uh, I'm just gonna start looking at it, wow. So obviously it's gonna be a little bit larger than the regular 15 Pro Max, which I have, which I'll be trading in. Uh, similar camera setup, so nothing too crazy with the phone. I mean, it's still, still gonna have that USB-C, but oh, here's the camera capture button that is definitely new. And it is a button, it is not a uh, capacitive touch. So that's interesting. Let's uh, check out what else we get in here and uh, typical USB-C to USB-C cable that is braided. I believe we had a braided cable last year too. Some uh, reviewers were saying it was new, but I don't think it was. And then just paperwork, that's it. All that boring stuff. I waited all day for this thing, but you know what? I'm gonna set it up, check it out, and then I'm gonna go ahead and play with it. But let's just get a quick size comparison of the 16 Pro Max with the iPhone 15 Pro Max. So again, 6.7 inches, 6.9 inches. So, I mean, barely any height difference. I mean, it's taller, but I mean, you're really not gonna, gonna notice it. Yeah, I'm holding both in my hand and they're both just large phones. So that's not a problem. Not a problem at all. So. I mean, this is nice. The color's very light. I don't, I don't know if the camera can pick it up, but it's um, got a very like pink tone to the whole kind of back glass. The sides are a bit more of like a goldish color, but yeah, the the back glass almost looks like a rosy pink color, which is interesting. Not exactly what I was expecting, I'll be honest, but. I don't know. I'm excited. I just got this thing. I'm really happy. I'm going to be unboxing it. Stay tuned. I'm not going to open it, play with it or anything like that because I'm going to be making a separate video coming out right after this of my favorite privacy screen protector. That's right. This uh, screen protector, I don't know the name of the company, but I will leave an affiliate link down below here in this video and in the next video as well, just so you can get it because I'm just going to peel this bad boy off, put on my brand new privacy screen protector and enjoy it. But yeah, super excited to finally have my phone in my hands. I'll be honest, I was very concerned I wasn't gonna get it today and I got it. So now I'm gonna make a video unboxing it, or excuse me, make a video putting the privacy glass screen protector on it and then edit this. So you're seeing all this stuff as it's going live. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe if you love this type of content and yeah, see you guys later.